Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. Yep, y'all, it is today, and today is my birthday. <laughs> ah, hey, June babies. Mad shout out to everybody. Now, before we get into this budget, let me just say how I'm feeling. I am feeling like I am so tired. Look, this went from yesterday to today. Yesterday, I wasn't tired. Today, I am tired of living by such a... um strict budget not even strict i guess what it is is i don't really give myself a whole lot of money and sometimes i just want to ball out i want to feel like i'm balling like i can do that and you know what's actually driving this conversation microblading i want to get my eyebrows microbladed then i looked up the freaking price for microblading and i don't know how much it is in y'all's area but what I looked up, it was like, it ranged between $350 and $800. Um, the good one was like about between six to $800. I haven't even called and got the real price yet. Um, but just to get them touched up, it was like $50 if you get them touched up in less than three months. It was $250 if it was more than three months. $300 for six months? No, yeah, six months. And then I think it was 600 for 12 months. So if getting them touched up is 600 I don't even know how much they cost from scratch. But I want them. But budget says that uh, that's not a wise financial move. But I'm tired of living by wise financial moves all the time. So I don't know. We're going to see how this plays out. I'm just letting y'all know how I'm feeling today in June on my birthday. I feel like I should be able to get whatever I want because I work hard and I make good money and I pretty much don't really have debt like that, like that, like that. But let's talk about this budget. For June, $11,605 is what I will be bringing home after taxes, after my 401k deductions, and after payroll benefits such as medical health insurance, eye insurance, dental insurance, and life insurance. So 11605 is what I have to work with. 700 is going to go to gifts and that leaves me $10,905, 95 for HOA, $100 for the gas and that is an guesstimate. 305 for the electricity, that is an actual I yeah electricity is still running pretty high 215 for the cell phone and that brings us to 215 wait a minute wait where am I wait 215 for the cell phone and that brings us to ten thousand one hundred and ninety dollars and as you see I do Dave Ramsey zero base budget so I am assigning every single dollar a task all the way till I get down to zero so then I'm gonna put $80 for the internet bill a hundred and twenty twenty dollars for the security systems on two homes two hundred and seventy dollars for insurances and that's for three cars um, health insurance I pay for somebody else and home warranty insurance for one of my properties and that brings me to nine thousand seven hundred and twenty dollars twenty five dollars to the easy pass and then $220 to get three cars registered. And it's if it's highlighted, that means because it's not a regular expense. It's a, it's a di it's a either different or something has changed, okay? So then $200 for the housekeeper who comes in bi-weekly to clean this house. This house. Crazy, right? Who oh, I tell you. Um, $120 for the person who comes in and mows my lawn. And that leaves me with $9,155. $35 for my subscription services. And that is Netflix. That is MoviePass. That is, what's that other thing? Oh, working out, which I don't do. And $5 to Patreon. $75 for my nails. I do not plan on getting my hair done this month either because again my hair is in a state of struggle um we're probably going to show that in one of these videos because my hair was looking a hot mess in one video so much so i didn't even make the video i pretty much cried the rest of the day okay 95 dollars for a credit card fee that is highlighted because um it's one of the annual 
card fees. And that get, leaves me with $8,950. And then $150 for Home Depot. And I'm going to talk about that Home Depot a little later in another video that I made. Um, $700, $700 towards tax preparation. Um, I haven't done my taxes, so I plan on doing my taxes this month in June. Um, and then that leaves me with $8,100. And twelve hundred gets to go to savings or microblading, um, <laughs> savings. And then I am going to send six thousand two hundred dollars to my mortgage because one of my long-term goals and dreams is to finally have this house paid off. But right now, I'm kind of resenting being a girl who has all these big dreams because it's like sometimes I just want to play and I just want to have fun especially when it seems like that's what the rest of the world does and I know it seems like that's what I do too but I really am thrifty I don't really splurge a lot y'all um and then that leaves me with seven hundred dollars seven hundred dollars is for the rest the rest is for food the rest is for entertainment the rest is for miscellaneous spending like if I decide I need toilet paper or if I decide I need some nail polish who knows um, and then that brings us down to zero. And that is my zero base budget for the month of June, my birthday month. I'm going to talk to y'all a little later today, except that the video probably won't come out. So who knows when I'm so backed up in video editing. So until next time, y'all, thank you all so much for rocking with me. Thank you to all of the new subscribers. I hope you are enjoying the content. And thank you, everybody who leaves comments, who leaves thumbs ups, and who have subscribed. Until next time, peace.